Today's Sunday. Me and Jamie have come to my parents' holiday let with Bunny and the two dogs. Basically, the week was free. There was no guests staying here, so they've let us stay here. I have filmed here before when I've stayed previously, but um, hopefully it doesn't get booked whilst we're here, otherwise we'll have to move all our stuff out. It's a bit late in the day. I haven't filmed anything yet today because I forgot. But basically, we was at my Nana's most of the day because Jamie was doing some work for her outside in the garden. And then we came here, we did the fire, and we watched I'm a Celebrity, basically. Mm -hmm. Currently, Jamie is getting Bonnie changed. Mm -hmm. Hello, Bonnie. Getting her all cosy. But yeah, I'll do a tour tomorrow for those people that haven't seen it. But I got my nails done this morning. I got candy cane mm -hmm. nails like this. I thought that was cute. And mm -hmm. the woman like painted these lines on. I thought she did a good job. They're quite neat. Literally, I showed her a picture and she did exactly what was on the picture. Um, so yeah, these are going to be my nails for the next three weeks. But anyway, I'm not going to film too much now, but mm -hmm. I will carry on filming for the rest of the week whilst we're here and you will see what we get up to. I got you then. I got you then. Yeah. Oh, do, 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 do. Hopefully she I sleeps. You. Daddy. Kiki. You Sorry guys, I forgot to bring your beds, just saying. Hopefully the floor's comfortable enough. <laughs> it is now Monday, so I am here in the house by myself, well, the bungalow. Jamie has gone to work. I made myself a coffee and I'm just watching some YouTube. I've sterilised Bonnie's bottles. I've washed up. Well, I put them in the dishwasher and i've got ready which is basically just putting clothes on washing my face and tying my hair up in a comfortable hairstyle and i had a bit of watermelon um i'm on a, a bit of a diet basically at the minute and what's worked for me over the past kind of like month to lose weight so far is having watermelon or a fruit for breakfast literally just that and then a couple of coffees in the day and then at kind of lunchtime, I'll have just a little bit of porridge. And that I'm, that actually is working for me because throughout the whole day, if I eat too much food or if I eat like a substantial amount of food during the day, I have like zero energy. I'm really tired and I just can't be bothered to do anything. So for me, not eating too much during the day keeps me up, motivated, doing my workouts, doing stuff, being productive. And then... In the evening I'll have like a normal meal and then before bed I'll have like a little sweet snack thing and that's just what's worked for me so far. I've lost weight before like a year ago well like a few years ago and I did it completely differently where I would have like breakfast lunch tea like very specific but I felt like I just was focusing on calories too much and I feel like if I eat less during the day then I don't have to worry too much about the calories in the evening and I roughly know how many calories are in the meal that I'm eating in the evening but I'm just not having to be like really really strict with measuring everything and weighing everything out like I just measure and weigh the important things like the calorific items during this whole weight loss thing because I just want to and they just be the, like the fittest and healthiest that I can be and my workouts have helped. I've definitely, I'm a lot fitter than I was like a month ago because obviously I did give birth a few, well, a couple of months ago. Um, so it's just me trying to get myself back to how I used to be with my fitness and it would just make me feel a lot better. And I've enjoyed it. I've enjoyed um, having a routine. Routine for me is everything. Anyway, I'll stop waffling. I don't really know why I went into that. Mum and dad are coming over tonight and my brother for a meal and I'm thinking of cooking like a cheesy pasta with a barbecue and bacon chicken cheese melt thing. It sounds very random but I'm trying to use stuff up in the house. So yeah, I look very rough but when you're on maternity leave, you don't do your makeup every single day. Instagram, the app on it's 
today is now, I thought it was Wednesday. Today is now Tuesday. I've just fed Bonnie some milk. So she's sorted. She slept quite well last night. She slept for like eight hours. So that was amazing because obviously it means I don't have to wake up constantly through the night. Um, she has been sleeping, fingers crossed, she has, will continue this, but she has been sleeping really well um, over the past few weeks. So that's good. I didn't film too much yesterday. I wanted to film a lot more like with my parents over and what I cooked and stuff. But if I'm honest, I just totally forgot because I used to film so many videos on you on YouTube and I used to just really have like such a passion for like filming loads of different videos, but I don't really have that anymore. Um, but I still want to post videos because then they're good to look back on. And I do still enjoy doing YouTube, but not as much as before. So maybe I just need to get back into it. But today, Jamie's at work again. It has actually snowed. So I'll show you that in a minute. But my mum is going to come around tonight and she said she might pick us up like an M&S meal deal thing that they do. And also um, she's going to come around. We're going to watch Bake Off because Jamie's at darts tonight. So he won't be here for a few hours in the evening. And we're just going to have like a cozy evening. I've asked her to look to see if she can pick up these ginger and white chocolate cookies from M&S because a lot of people have been obsessed with them and going on about them. So I want to see if they've got any of those. So hopefully they have. So it did snow a little bit yesterday. Obviously there's not that much there. There was a bit more this morning, but not tons. Um, not enough to be snowed in anyway, let's just put it that way. Um, but yeah, the first snow of the year. So I did say that I would film a little tour of the bungalow if you haven't seen it. So I will just do that quickly now. Cupcakes and Teddy should not be on the table. But it's okay because mum lets them on the table and this is mum's holiday let. So. so this room is like the dining room slash kitchen. This area here is obviously like to eat in. Obviously there's dogs on the table, but don't worry, they will clean it before the next guests. Um... I haven't actually used that since I've been here. The kitchen is probably my favourite room in the house, maybe joint with the living room, but it's just like nice and spacious. Like if I, you know, had a dream kitchen, it would be something like this, where you've kind of got like an island section in the middle where you can sit at. And I just want to have space. Like I definitely want a bigger house than what I've got now, just for the fact of wanting a bigger kitchen. But this is what the room sort of looks like like this we have a utility room in here for utilities washing and stuff like that then we've got a big hallway which is like probably the biggest like widest hallway i've ever seen it's like a room in itself basically we've got the twin room in here which i have had the door closed because my parents have got it all clean ready for the next guest so i don't want to um you know mess it up or the dogs come piling in here or anything and then there's like a bathroom in here or a shower room there's a shower and then a toilet and a sink you can see outside guys out we don't want your muddy paws in here thank you very much we there is the front door by the way we do have like a little toilet in here i call it the downstairs toilet um obviously this is a bungalow so it there isn't a downstairs everywhere is downstairs um but this is the main bedroom this is where me and jamie have been sleeping hence why the bed is a mess um got all bonnie's little bits and bobs but yeah she's been sleeping in the crib next to me this fell off in the night so i need to like put that back on and then in here is the bathroom um, one of the dogs pooed on that mat, so I had to fold that up. It was probably this dog. Um, yeah, the bath is here. I like the fact that there's two sinks. And that's what kind of like the front of the house looks like in terms of like the front area. There's like a little garagey area. Now, my either my favourite or my second favourite room is the living room, which is here. It's very cosy. Oh, sorry, I just woke Bonnie up. She was having a little nap um but yeah the fireplace is probably like the best thing in this house it's just so big and we have had a couple of fires i will have another fire and show you in this video but yeah the fireplace is just the best um part of this house in my opinion 
but yeah very cozy living room and then we can come through into this which is probably like it's what they call the snug it's like another kind of separate room with a tv i personally like if i built this house would have turned this room into something else or i wouldn't have built this because i don't see the point in having like a second living room but there we go and this basically just takes us round back into the kitchen where we started so that's a little tour of the house i am now going to do a workout and then i'm going to watch some downton abbey and not really too much else until Jamie gets back from work. Me and Bunny have been chilling. Hello, Bunny. Hello. Hello, Papa. Hello. Hello. Smile. Smile. Okay, she didn't want to smile. Um, just had another coffee. Just waiting for Jamie to come home. And. Oh yeah, I'm going to do another workout actually. I do one in the morning and one in the afternoon. Mum's here. She made it. It's food, Thai food from m &S. Yeah. We're just dishing up. And we've got these cookies. These are gingerbread white chocolate cookies from m and And everyone's been going on about them and I really want one. So here they are. I don't want one. Oh God, this is so hot. That was karma. It's now Wednesday, Buddy is crying a bit. She's just had some milk, so I'm not entirely sure why she's actually crying. Um, but yeah, she's Teddy. Um, the dogs have made a mess on the floor. I don't know if you can see that, but it's basically wood from the fire um, that Teddy got and he's been chewing it, thinking it's one of his toys. Teddy, shh, what are you barking at? Nobody goes there. They love barking. Should we sort you out, Bubbo? <laughs> I feel like I'm very far away. Um, me and Jamie are going to be going to McDonald's tonight. Now, this does sound very strange, but every single time McDonald's has a new menu, I want to try it. Even if it's stuff that I've had before and tried before, it's something different. And it makes me sound like I'm addicted to McDonald's, but I don't know why. Like, I just feel like, oh, it's cheap and I like it and I want to try it. This menu that's coming out today, so it literally comes out today and I'm going, um, is the Christmas menu, so the festive menu, and it's my favorite one every single year. Like they always bring out the same things every year and this is my favorite one that they do. And I don't know if, because there is some new stuff that they haven't done before, but the Big Tasty is my favorite burger that McDonald's do. So I'm excited to have that. And also they do these cheese melt dippers, which are the best like cheese bites that they do all year, in my opinion, because they've got like a mature, like cheddar-y flavor. I just love them. And also they brought out some like chocolate orange um, McFlurries and also a chocolate orange, I think it's a chocolate orange like pie and a bunch of other stuff. I think they've also got a new burger as well, which is like a cheesy, it's like a chicken burger, but with like a cheese slice and like a cheese sauce. I haven't tried that before, so I might try that at some point. But we're going to go soon. I'm just waiting for him to get back from work. Um, I think Bonnie's crying, so I'll have to go to her. But she's literally just had a nappy change and just had food. Um, but yes, yeah, so I'll give you my opinion on the chocolate orange McFlurry because I haven't had that before, but I'm pretty sure it will be fine. I haven't eaten yet today so i'm quite hungry because at the minute i'm like calorie counting um so i'm in a calorie deficit so i'm just trying to like make sure i have the same amount of calories every day and mcdonald's does have a lot of calories in it so i haven't had anything yet today except for some watermelon and a couple of coffees but yeah i need to go bonnie's crying Whoa. oh it's dark we've got in the car and it's got all iced up so we're having to wait for it to defrost, yeah. which is not fun because it's going to be ages because it's thick on my window screen. Look, all icy. Oh, cozy. Oh my god, it looks like she just said hi. I've just lit the fire. Nice. Jamie. I did. 
We've only got this amount of wood left. <laughs> so it won't be a long fire, but I'm a celebs on soon and then we go to bed anyway. You look so cozy. Hey guys. I think my phone's a bit wet, so the camera's a bit blurry. But the fire's going. We're about to watch I'm a Celebrity. We've got wine. Got wine. I'm new to this wine scene. Yep, Jamie's only just started drinking wine. White wine anyway, not red wine. So we've both got some wine. This is the bottle. He got it from the co-op the other day. We went to McDonald's and I got my Big Tasty, which I would rate 10 out of 10. And considering I hadn't eaten anything all day, it was extra good. Well, and there yeah, there's loads of people in there. Um, or angry people. Yeah. yeah. Um, the cheese bites, 10 out of 10. I feel like I've got makeup under here. Why is that warm? What? Wine. Oh crap, I didn't put it in the fridge. White wine's meant to be in the fridge. Mm. It was in the cupboard. It's not warm warm though, is it? Disappointed. Um, red wine's meant to be drank warm, but not yeah. white wine. Um, so yeah, cheese bites 10 out of 10. And then the Terry's chocolate orange, but flurry. We both got a mini, oh no, I got a mini one. Um, I would rate that an eight out of 10. So yeah, the review nobody needs. Today is Thursday. It's actually nearly nine in the night time. So, oh, don't cry. I'm filming. Um, so I'm actually gonna watch I'm a Celebrity soon. I've got a cup of tea. I need to show you to prove as evidence. Here it is. Um, funny. Uh, sorry if you can hear a crying baby. We've just been to at a local pub here it's literally like a two minute walk and it's funny because we drove <laughs> because um we needed bonnie's car seat because we didn't have a pram with us so we thought instead of carrying her that way even though it's not really that long hello <laughs> um anyway i ordered a salad and i thought i'll be healthy even though i'm not entirely sure how healthy it is because it had a lot of stilton on it um, but I ordered the Stilton and Walnut and Grape Salad and I was thinking, because either with salads you can either like have like a really good salad with loads of different bits on it or you can just get like lettuce, tomato and cucumber and they just tell you that's a salad, um, which I guess it is as well. Um, but it came and I think I have a picture of it, it's got like bread on it which was really nice and loads of different salad -y bits and they put loads of Stilton on and I really like Stilton, I like pretty much any cheese so for me that was like really good. And the walnuts were really nice. Hello. And like a little dressing. I would rate that a 10 out of 10. Like I would 100% buy that again. Um, one of the best meals I've had in ages. And then for pudding, I don't think I actually showed it. Um, but it was like a chocolate fudge cake thing. And that was really nice as well. And Jamie had a York, like a giant Yorkshire pudding with mash and sausages inside it. Um, and it, yeah, it was really good. And it was reasonably priced as well. So we went there today. Other than that, we didn't really do anything. I was just at home and Jamie was at work. Tomorrow, we're off to Sheffield and we're going to stay somewhere for a couple of nights there in like an apartment because we want to go to a Christmas market. Can't go to Lincoln Christmas market anymore because it cancelled um, last year and it's not going to come back on. Uh, we was going to go to Manchester or York Christmas markets, but they're just too busy. So we thought we'll go to Sheffield. So I'm going to put this post up, but this is going to be the end of this weekly vlog. And then I'm going to have that as a separate video just to have it as its own video. Because normally in a weekly vlog, I would try and film from Sunday through till Saturday. But I'm going to have Friday, Saturday um and sunday as like its own video so thanks for watching bunny say bye bye say bye bye bunny uh, bye bye <laughs>
No. Okay, she can't talk yet. Oh, I had a dream last night that she said her first word. I can't remember what it was, but I think it was something weird. It was like John or something. Well, it absolutely beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Absolutely beautiful.